It's Heidi and Chili King back for our second video of the June. <laughs> we haven't had many videos lately, uh, and I explained some of it in the last video about my buddy Steven passing away, but uh, part of it really, or the biggest part really, is his schedule. Um, I have a practice every day. That's, he, well, that's really not awesome. every day, but almost every day, and he's got two some days. It's like today you got three. <laughs> he's got basketball workout, base, uh, baseball workout, and baseball practice. Tonight. Or hitting. You got hitting. I have two today. I have three. I have you have three? I just spelled them out. You had a school baseball workout, a school basketball not, workout. Not this morning. Yesterday morning. Whatever. Okay. <laughs> Forget it. Tomorrow it's when you have three. Yes. Or you were going to have three and I canceled one of them. Whatever. He's got a lot going on. Yes. Uh, I got a haircut too. Look at it. Yeah. I got it cut over my ears for the first time. In my time. All right. <laughs> So today, guys, we went to a, uh, a, a place that most of you can't get. Uh, <laughs> it's not really local, but... It is local it's to like, Alabama. It's Alabama. It's not like local, like, only in Athens. No. It's local to the state of Alabama. We've done it many times before, and it's Jack's. One thing I will say about Jack's right now, they have brought back the bologna. I don't, know why they don't, I don't know why they don't leave it on the menu all the time. There's Jack's, but they don't. Don't ask me why. I love their package. Their yeah, they also have this comeback sauce that's really good. Yes, I, we've tried a video. We'll leave this. Okay, so along with the bologna, they recently came out with a line of three chicken sandwiches, new chicken sandwiches. Spicy chicken sandwich we're trying today. And so we're trying the spicy chicken sandwich today. I think one of them is a club, and I, I didn't see the other one on the menu. Maybe maybe it was just two. Okay, I'm going to open mine up. Okay, so... So this is their, uh, they came out with a new chicken sandwich, what, what was that, about a year ago? I'll have to go oh. back and look. We did, a, we reviewed it. It was really good, actually. Um, this, it has pepper jack cheese and it has a sauce on it. We still don't know. Yeah, we don't know. It's it's just called the spicy chicken sandwich from Jack's. It does have pepper jack cheese. We, we can see love, that. We love pepper jack cheese. Yeah, you can see the pepper jack cheese. It's, look, it's not it really pickles. melted, which is a little disappointing that it's not fully melted. It does have pickles and then it has that sauce on the bottom and it has sauce on the top. I've seen that sauce before on something we've tried. I, it, may be, it looks like comeback sauce, but I don't. We just, so we don't know what it is. They have awesome buns. Look, Chick-fil-A, take a cue from Jack's buns. Look at yes. that. Chick-fil-A has the worst buns in the business. That kind of sounds good. I'm looking good. at you, Chick-fil-A, because kind of you got good chicken, but your bun's no good. <laughs> that kind of sounds good. All right, good. so this is the spicy chicken sandwich from Jack's. You getting spicy from that? A little bit. Yeah. It's good. Yeah. Okay, I got a little hint of spice. That bun, look at that chicken. And that bun, they might have the best buns in the business. They might. What's the sauce? Some, it's not comeback sauce. It's kind of spicy. It's like pepper. Pepper spicy. As you know, I will go look it up on their website and I will tell you what it is. It is a little spicy. That that one's, that one's bringing some heat right there. Mm -hmm. So what do you think about it, honey? I mean, look how thick that chicken is. That Their chicken is really good. Mm -hmm. They don't sell that there. They sell Pepsi. Coke. I think they're a Coke product. I don't know really. I'm gonna say it like I say it all the time. Jack's has amazing French fries. They're the big crinkle Zaxby's. fries. They're just like Zaxby's. I agree. By the way, this is comeback sauce. That's that's the. By the way, our Zaxby's burned not to the ground, but they had a fire. Hey, we have, call your mother and ask her what she wants. Tell her we're doing a video. Um, <laughs> let me dip in that comeback sauce. Anyway, mm -hmm. our so our sauce has been shut down for a while. Uh -huh. So we've been going to other places. All right, mm, the comeback sauce. And up. every time we go to a different city, we get Zaxby's. Or I, I have, don't. I but have. You might. So look. So the only downfall to this is that the cheese isn't melted. They're pretty mild though. 
That's good. Give me a synopsis on it, honey. A what? A synopsis. Give me a short couple of sentences on what you think about this sandwich and describe what you like about it or dislike about it. Okay. I like the spiciness. Mm -hmm. I like the chicken. I like the bun. Mm -hmm. But like the heat is weird. It like I don't know what it is really. I don't know what it Usually is. Usually I can seek it out, but I really can't with this. Then you come out with a separate sauce. It's definitely not buffalo. Uh -uh. Not comeback sauce. It's not comeback. It is kind of peppery hot. Mm. I will say this though about Jack. And I've said it once before and I'm going to say it again in the same video. They got the best buns on the market. Mm -hmm. The fact that Chick-fil-A can't match their bun game makes no sense to me. I'll tell you who else has a really good bun. And that's Popeye's. Popeye's is a good bun. Mm -hmm. Alright, so you ready to grade this? I'm ready. Like this, this is, I'm sure it's limited time. Jack's brings out a ton of stuff. I'll give them credit. They can... There's a fly in here. They come out with stuff all the time. They leave it for a while. They take it away. I guess if it does well, it, they bring it back. It could be a milkshake, a sandwich. But here's what I was told about Jack's. I was told that Jack's, like Chick-fil-A, has a limited menu. Item. Like they, They're only going to serve so many things. They're not going to add something without taking something away. Mm -hmm. So, anyway. Jack's has the best fast food BLT I've ever eaten. Mm -hmm. and, I, and I'm going to be honest with you, I get those quite often. All right, so Huddy, you ready to grade this thing? I'm ready. Huddy, what would you give on a zero to five scale? The spicy chicken sandwich from Jack's where a zero is that god awful hot pocket. You want me to bring that hot pocket up again? Please don't. And a five is uh, the pimento cheese mac and cheese from Bojangles. What would you give this? A 4.75. Hmm. You like it. The only thing bad about it is that like, the spice is weird. The sauce is weird. But it's good. Did you, you, so you can't figure out what it is? No, that's the reason I'm giving it a 7.5. My nose is running. I'm going to give it a four and a half. <clears throat> I like it a lot. I like it a lot. I would get it again. Would you get it again? Mm hmm. Well, I've had better. The chicken is top notch, so I'll, I'll be honest with you. They got really good chicken. Mm -hmm. Really good bun. I wish the cheese was melted. And I don't love that sauce. I don't know. It's kind of a weird. I'm with you. It's kind of a weird peppery. I'm going to find out what it is. She'd have put like a. I don't know, just something different. I honestly think it would have been better if it was a buffalo sauce. Oh. Or if it was like a French Red Hot or something, something like that. I don't know. I don't know what it is. It's like a creamy heat. Quirma, you hear the dog? Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, we hope, as a group, a, a duo, that we're going to be back making some videos. We actually have several things we are ready to review. Can I uh, talk about... What's coming to Madison? You can. It's already open. It opened a yesterday, I think. Culver's, which mm -hmm. is not a South restaurant, usually. You don't re usually see a Culver's. Right. So we plan on going and eating a butter burger from Culver's soon. If you live in the north or wherever Culver's is, we also, tell us what to get in the comments. Yeah, tell us if you've been to a Culver's what we should review. We also <clears throat> want to try the sweet potato fries at Arby's. Uh, Little Caesars has stuffed cheese uh, crazy bread. Or I don't even know what it's called. Sounds but good. Uh, we want to do that. We have several chips. We have several frozen pizzas. We have several things we're trying to get back to reviewing. It's all about time for us at this point. He's either at a sporting event, getting ready for a sporting event, coming back from a sporting event, or going to a friend's house to spend the night. I mean, it's seriously, it's like constant. So, as long as we don't get the COVID, we will try to do some videos. Yep. Matter of fact, we may do a couple this afternoon. Yeah, we might. So, anyway. So, thanks for watching. Jax, this is a good. This is good. Definitely good. 
And I gave you some ways to improve it. <laughs> but, you know what they could do? Just add Frank Turner Hot to Comeback Sauce and put it on there. <laughs> that might be, maybe that wouldn't even be bad. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we'll have to see. But, uh, so thanks. We may try the club next. I don't know. I feel like I've had the club. I don't think it's new. I think it was out before and they just brought it back out. But anyway, it was listed at, like on the line of new sandwiches, but I don't think it said new beside it. Anyway, thanks uh, for watching and we'll be back soon. There went uh, Wit just walked by. All right, we'll see you soon for... Honey. And it's like... We're out to this box. Bye.